Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. This channel, Aveda Science, is all about trying to learn various concepts of data science by practicing a lot of questions. This video is in continuation of the series where we are trying to learn Python by solving interview questions from top tech companies like Facebook, Amazon, Apple, Netflix, and Google. If you are preparing on any of these roles, this is a great series to follow and try to build your concepts. So, yeah, let's jump right in. In this video, we are going to solve this question on status scratch regarding first three most watched videos. This question has been asked in Google and Netflix, and it's a great question if you are preparing for data engineer, data scientist, BI analyst, data analyst, or ML engineer roles. The question reads after after a new user creates an account and starts watching videos, the user ID, video ID and the date watched are captured in the database. Find the top 3 videos most users have watched as their first 3 videos. Output the video ID and the number of times it has been watched as the user's first 3 videos. In the event of a tie, output all the videos in the top 3 that users watched as their first 3 videos. So we are given a data frame called videos watched and expected output is a pandas data frame which has basically the top 3 videos watched by the people as their first 3 videos. So it might sound confusing but like you know let's inquire about this data frame called videos watched. So here you have 3 different columns user id, video id and watched at. To solve this question we need to perform ranking and boolean indexing at 2 levels. Firstly what we need to do is for every user id we need to find out which video was watched first then what which one is second third and fourth then out of all the rankings we need to only consider the first three videos watched by every user so that is level one once you are there then what you need to do is you need to again group by the video and try to get okay which all videos are now the highest watched so let's go step by step and it will be very clear so first thing that we need to do is for every user id let's try to get the rank based on the watched at date time the earliest should get rank one so we are going to create another column let's call it watch order so let me do watch order and here what we need is for every user id arranged by watched at an increasing manner get the ranking so what we need to do is videos watched and then let's group by the user id then take the watched at column and then perform the ranking so rank and then there are various methods of ranking first last minimum dense etc in our case we need dense ranking so method is equal to dense and by default it is going to be by ascending order of watched at so but you know just to make it explicit let me write ascending is equal to true okay now let me look at the videos watched so videos what and let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get so now here you have for every user id which was their first watch order which was which video was the, the second third etc so for example if you look at this one right uid 02 user id 2 rank 1 because on 8th of january 2022 at 7 am this person watched this video and then on same day 9 am this person was the second video and so on once you have these ranks then what you need is we need the first three videos watched by the users so we need to perform a boolean indexing and do that okay videos watched watch order should be less than equal to three so i do less than equal to three and then this is going to give you a true false values and basically if you pass this by the original so videos watched and this is going to keep only those rows where these boolean values were true so if i go ahead and run this it is going to keep all the rows where watch order was less than equal to three so now this is the first three videos watched by the user let's save this in a data frame let's call that as first three now once we have this then what we can do is we can now go ahead and group so now we have the first three videos watched by each of the users then in that category we need to find out which videos were watched the maximum number of times the top three one right so firstly let's try to get okay in the first three videos which videos were watched how many times so what we can do is we can do first three and then group by the video id column and then video id column and then use the dot aggregate method that we learned about and what is the 
final value of the column that we want n in first three so n in first three and then what we can do is we need to provide a tuple so we need to take the video id column and perform a count so video id and then perform the count and since this is going to be as an index so we need to reset the index so that we know that okay which particular video was was how many times so reset index okay now let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get so in the first three videos of each of the users this particular video was was two two times this was seven times eight times four times etc now once we have this from this we need to take the first three so what we can do is we can you know store this in another data frame let's call this top now we need to create a column called rank right so top rank basically in this so obviously just by looking at it this should be the first highest right then these two are second highest then this is the third highest this is the fourth highest and so on so we need to get that ranking so top rank is equal to data frame that we created which is we are calling top so we need to take the n in first three so n in first three and then perform the rank and the method of ranking should be dense so dense and it should be highest value in this column should get rank one so ascending is equal to false okay now let me go ahead and try to see this data frame called top so now here you have this right so this is rank one these are rank two rank three and so on now how do i know method equal to dense here because in the question it says in the event of a tie output all the videos in the top three that users watched so that can only be achieved if you are ranking through dense ranking because even if there are ties it never skips the rank so now once we have this we are only required to keep the top three then we take the rank column and that should be less than equal to three and again this is second level of boolean indexing so you pass this to top and then we are only required to keep the video id and the n in first three columns so we provide the list so video id and n in first three now let me go ahead and run this let's see what do we get here so here we have the video ids and n in first threes and if i look at my expected output this is the same as well so i think this looks good let me go ahead and submit it so pass all the test cases so everything is green and this is how to do it so yes somewhat tricky question because here you have to do boolean indexing as well as perform the ranks at two different levels but what we did basically was firstly we read for every user id what is the watch order of the videos then once we have the watch order of the videos we are only required to consider top three watches of every user so we did that in this second row and then once we are aligned with those first three watches of every user then we grouped by the different videos and counted that okay this particular video was watched how many times and then we ranked them highest to lowest and kept only the top three so yeah, this is how we do it let me know if there's a better way or more efficient way to solve this question let the solution be in the comment section below and i'll see you guys in the next video